Let's talk about reverse mentorship. So for those who don't know, what does reverse mentorship mean and how can it help you as the mentee kind of turned mentor? Okay. Um, I believe there are two types of um, reverse mentoring. Um, the first primarily in, in, in enables a uh, leaders in senior position to put together leaders or senior people with junior people and ask them for help mostly in two areas one is digital help um, you know systems that they can use to help productivity and the other thing that they're looking for is um, uh, they're looking for cultural change uh, ways that they can r improve their diversity now, you may not have any control over this, but it's really important for the, men, men, the the senior person that you're going to mentor. It's really important that they be engaged and listen to in what you're saying. If they have no interest, it's it's really no help to anyone. But um, you know, the, it, it it it's just one of those things that you have no control over. Hopefully, you get someone that's interested, but you have no control over that. As far as the junior person, this is a great opportunity to sit in front of a senior person and give your input. That's what they're asking for. You get to do that and, and uh, prove your leadership skills as well as enhance your leadership skills. There's another type of reverse mentoring. Let's say that you have a mentor. It's not something where the corporation is put together, but you have a mentor and you have an opportunity uh, to help that, that person. Maybe it's the same type of issue where you can provide them with digital help. Now, they may not be interested in um, the how-to, how to work a spreadsheet or so forth and so on, but they may be interested in that, hey, there's an application that's available out there and that they can take that idea of the application or the specific use of Excel back to their team and say, hey, this, th this is available. It will help uh, improve productivity. Why don't you check into that so that they can plant a seed in their staff the other thing that's maybe possible is that uh, your mentor may ask about their own interpersonal skills. And if they do, this is your opportunity to be truthful and honest, but you know, you don't want to hurt them. You don't want to cut deep. Um, Got to be very constructive. Um, if they have interpersonal issues and they don't ask about them, I wouldn't volunteer. 